forward to tell you that this film was produced entirely in an LED volume in only four days, with real-time compositing and no VFX added in post-production. Would you believe it? Moreover, only three physical props were used to make the whole movie. A medical table, the rock the characters were standing on, and then this airlocked door. How did we do this? This door is actually three meters away from the LED panels on set. But in the monitor, it looks like it is very much a part of the dilapidated spaceship. So what we did here was to use depth enhancement technology to extend our virtual set outwards to connect seamlessly with our physical door. No matter how our camera moved, the real and virtual settings stayed synchronized to show one whole spaceship. See here, if we didn't show our crew member walking through the wall here, nobody would know that there's actually nothing physical there. In the final climax of the movie, the entire scene was created with only one real physical prop, the medical table. Everything else in the scene was a digital asset. The physical table was placed within the virtual environment and matched in both position and proportions to the virtual devices comprising the rest of the medical table. So in camera, what we see is a single high-tech operating table. As we dolly in, everything looks accurate in camera. Our perspective and the depth of field of the virtual environment change automatically with the camera's movements. What we did here was to turn the digital assets on the LED screen into in-camera foreground items. What looks like the foreground is actually on the LED panels in the background. In the real world, foreground items move quicker. With the real-time processing of our computers, the effects that we see in-camera follow the laws of real physics, so that our LEDs can trick our eyes to portray different physical relationships that don't exist in reality. We created the vast exterior scenes of the alien planet with only one physical rock. Our low angle shot here shows the wreckage of the spacecraft in the background. In order to be convincing, the fluttering effects of the virtual cloth in the back had to match the direction and wind speeds of the real world fan blowing at our actors. <laughs> <laughs> then, to create the shot with the camera slowly rising, we placed the rock less than two meters away from the LED panels to prevent the floor of the LED stage from entering the frame. We chose to use a smaller aperture and shoot from an extremely high angle to achieve the appearance of the actors kneeling at the edge of a deep abyss. After three years of extensive R&D, we've developed several core technologies, including the elimination of moray patterns, seamless camera tracking, and virtual focus pulling that together form the versatile virtual production system. These technologies support us to create all kinds of amazing blended virtual and physical solutions that allow us to minimize physical set dressing and enable us to shoot complicated and VFX heavy scenes in real time. Check out the film in the link below. We hope you like it.